This is my 2006 uh, Chevy Equinox. And most definitely when you do the oil change, uh, there's a 3.4 liter. Uh, when you look up here, you can see that's a 3.4 liter. And there is a 3.6 liter. Since this is the 3.4 liter, this is 5W30. This is going to be 4.5 quarts. And <clears throat> rule of thumb, when you do take out the engine oil cap here, you want to put it right there. Only tools you'll need for this one is going to be a 13 millimeter. That's going to be for your drain plug. Filter wrench. <clears throat> if your filter is on there super tight. Need your engine oil, which is gonna be 5W30. For the 3.4, it says you're gonna need 4.5 quarts. Uh, I'll take half a quart off of this and then dump the whole thing in there. So, if this were clock, clock would go clockwise this way, which is that way. We're gonna go counterclockwise. Should be easy, but uh, someone really tighten this one up. Loosen it up into the tent tight, and then after that, just go into the last thread. When you feel like it's the last thread, do one more turn, and then lift right up. Uh, the microguard select extended life 10k as far as the mileage. Part number is MSL51040. But just in case if they're over torqued, these are my favorite uh, filter wrench pliers. Let's put them on there. Turn. Just go ahead and take that off. Let it spin out for a second. The rest of the excess oil is going to come right down into our drip pan. I got gloves, so. You're in a hurry and you got gloves, just keep spinning it till it falls down. And you can see that for this one, they use the old filter, which is a 1040, and that's what Napa has down for the part number for this one. So now you know two filters that actually would be compatible and fit for this. Uh, vehicle right here. We'll let it drain off for a second then I'll clean this off and slap my new filter in there It doesn't take much to over torque it and definitely since this is my uh, first time filming underneath it I definitely want to wipe everything down just in case uh, I do have a leak I kind of want to identify what the leak is and fix the problem as soon as possible sixteen ounces is half a quart. And take four more just in case for spillage. Put in my five point four point five quarts. Take the can, turn it off one, two, three, and that's it. You see the light? Two Three, four, five, six. There we go. And that's it. Put fresh new oil in there. Did my sticker. And my sticker is up here. 3,000 miles is 205, 569, or 5,000 miles, 207, 569, 3K, 5K, 5W30, 4.5 quarts, and it takes a 13 millimeter in order for you to take the engine 
oil drain plug. What you do is pull out the oil, make sure you wipe it off with a dipstick, and you put it back in. Fresh, clean oil. It's within the first two bubbles. That means that it is half a quart low. Maybe about half, a couple ounces. You can always check it again. We'll check it again within a couple of days. I'm within the hash marks.